it, it's, it's, it's a little long. I, I cut about 10 verses out, but uh, I had to leave in enough to tell the story. And I uh, hope you enjoy it. Lloyd Bateman. a gentleman on the coast of Jordan, and he was a gentleman of a high degree. He never, never could rest contented till he had taken a voyage at sea. He sailed east, and he sailed to the west, and he sailed till he came to the Turkish shore, and there they caught a man hopes of freedom anymore. This turkey had but an only daughter, as fair one as ever you see. She stole the keys to her father's prison, and says, Lord Bateman, I'll go see. Have you houses, and have you land, and have you a living of a high degree? What would you give to a fair lady if out of prison would set you free? I have houses and I have land and I have a living of a high degree. I'd give it all to the fair lady if out of prison would set me free. She's taken him down to her father's cellar there she gave him wine so strong, and every drink she gave unto him, she wished Lloyd Bateman was her own. She's taken him down to her father's harbor, and there she bought the ship for him, saying, fare you well to land of living, I fear I'll never see you again. Seven long years, I'll make a promise. Seven long years, and here's my hand. If you will marry no other lady, it's I will marry no other man. Seven long years, I'll make that promise. Seven long years, then here's my hand. It's time to marry no other lady. You're to marry no other man. Seven long years have come over, seven long years, one, two, and three. When she packed up her gun jewelry and says, Lloyd Bateman, I'll go see. She sailed till she came to Lloyd Bateman's castle, and there she knocked. She made it ring. Lloyd Bateman sent his partner on it to see who's there that would come in. Is this, is this Lloyd Bateman's castle? And is Lloyd Bateman himself within? This is, this is Lloyd Bateman's castle. He just has brought his new bride in. Tell him to send me a slice of bread and a bottle of his wine so strong. And ask him if he remembers lady who set him free from prison strong. Lloyd Bateman rose up from his table and burst it into pieces of three, saying, fare you well to the land of living. That's my dear Susan's came to me. And then he spoke to the young bride's mother, your daughter's none the worse off by me. She came here on a horse and saddle and shall go home on a 
coach of three. She came here on a horse and saddle. Shall go home on a coach of three. And I'll go marry my darling Susan, who paid my way across the foaming sea. Roy Bader. Last year, um, I participated in an amazing uh, recording session in Texas where we, uh, the material was uh, various kinds of pre-war blues and a little bit of pre-war hillbilly music, a little bit of early western swing, and um, uh, earlier on in Rachel's set she was talking about um, Jimmy Rogers uh, being in the recording studio when he was dying of TB. Well, the, reason for this session, which was called Texas Sheiks, was that it was to distract a wonderful musician named Stephen Bruton, who was dying of cancer, and he had to, would have to go lie down between takes too, but still a lot of good music came out of it, and I'd like to play you one tune that we recorded on that, on that CD. This is a, a W.C. Handy tune through uh, the hillbilly sensibilities of the wise String orchestra, very wise indeed. And I think wise was their last name, and I'm not, I don't know where they were from. It's called Yellow Dog Blues. Mm -hmm. 